the development of a new living organism. The cells divide and align. Organs are formed as the embryo grows. New imaging techniques have enabled scientists to watch and study when life begins. At the Biocentrum in Basel, scientists are adapting these imaging techniques to study the development of blood vessels in zebrafish. Their research is part of a European project called Cells into Organs, which is funded by the European Commission. We want to find out how blood vessels are growing, and as the embryos happen to be transparent, and as we can collect several hundred embryos every day, it's a perfect subject to study the formation of new blood vessels right from the beginning. In order to make the development of blood vessels visible, the fish eggs are injected with special DNA molecules that will later make blood cells glow fluorescent. The gene encoding the fluorescent marker will only be activated inside the blood cells of the organism. Once the egg divides and turns into an embryo, the samples are placed under a special microscope with a laser light source. As soon as the first blood cells are formed, the scientists can observe the fluorescent blood vessel cells inside the embryo. This technique has enabled scientists to create unique images which show how cells turn into organs. Our discovery was that the blood vessel cells are not floating along on their own, but they seem to group and they interact with each other. The embryo of a zebrafish may look different compared to a human embryo, but its genes and the way they determine the growth of an organism is very similar. Life was once invented, and then it was refined. The new imaging techniques have opened a new chapter in studying biological processes. The new perspectives could not only help to solve developmental and evolutionary questions, but will also become relevant for medical research.